Don't forget to go to ashkicking.com for pound for pound the best home health and beauty fragrance products. This is Bobby and you're watching Dante's Boxing Nation. My man, Brother Fareed, he finally rocking that right yes, here. Let me it's about time, brain. Brother Fareed. Yeah, man, listen, it's not my fault, man. We've been, you look at the videos of how we've been rocking from the start. We've been getting in certain places when we got in. And you just was tight on the shirt, man. I'm finally <laughs> glad I got a good shirt. You know what I'm saying? From you. But uh, it's, it's always a pleasure rolling with you, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, always a pleasure to see you rocking it, man. Yeah, same, same, man. Same, yeah, man. Fun, man. That, that's, fun. that's what it is, man. I'm glad you finally got one. We done had... A busy weekend. Yes. Before I even ask what you've been up to, I gotta ask you, man. ESPN said this man was top 25, top five, one of the greatest fighters of all time in the last 25 years. Roman Gonzalez, he gets knocked out this weekend. Oh man! Your your reaction, your thoughts, man. Uh, well, you know, it's you, you got to look at the radio station, TV station, all that's going. Like we're in America, man. You know what I'm saying? America was founded on, on certain things. So, but I want to say that uh, HBO always hype their people up. They hype them up. They, they really like they, they set them up for, for failure every time. They hype these guys up how they're the best in the world, and they want to get knocked out. I like Roman. That's my guy, but you know, he fought a South Ball, South Ball had um you look at the foot placement, man. My wrestling guy used to always say position before submission. So the way he was positioned, his foot was in the inside, South Ball started throwing punches, landed the hook, dropped him, but you know, he was in the wrong placement. He just used to fighting and just throwing punches. Also, his weight situation, he's not that he had to come up and wait a lot of times because he had to find challenges, but he's a small guy, man, and it's sure. I mean, he got his ass with him. That happens. No excuse on that because he signed on the dollar line, but those things happen. Those things happen. Yeah. And the question is, can he recover? Um, I, mean, I think he can recover. Yeah. I think he can recover. Or, or come think back in, in his form. Yeah, I think he should fight at his, his weight class that he's comfortable in. If he can make fights. that weight, you know. Yeah, I think he should fight comfortable. But what I'm talking about, I'm waiting on, is how they pump Lomachenko up. There's mm. a guy named Riggin Dow. You know what I'm saying? He's a Cuban kid, really sharp. You know what I'm saying? He, they don't pump him up, but I'm waiting for that situation to happen. It's going to be another one bites the dust for HBO. For HBO. Man, that would be a bad year for HBO. Yes. Sergey Kovalev got yes. knocked out. Yes. They, they wasn't too crazy about Andre Ward, so right. Kovalev got knocked out. Roman gets knocked out. This was... Roman is actually the guy that Jim Lampley, he was like one of the first people to push that narrative yeah. that Roman was pound for pound over Andre Ward and everybody. You know, so Jim Lampley is getting old and sing out, man. He he, he got to he got to retire. You know what I'm saying? It's about time for him to get Did up. you hear what Jim just said about Floyd? Yes. You I just heard, heard what he garbage. said about Floyd? Yeah, he should fight a woman, this and that. You know, like taking shots like that. I mean, know? he's supposed to be a professional though. Like he, it's like it's extremely personal for he's Jim Lampley. You know, man. It started with uh, I remember when George Foreman stopped messing around. With him. He was saying some things when um, uh, it was a big thing with uh, Prince Nassim fought uh, Barrera, getting his butt with him, whatever the case is. But he started getting out of line then when he started talking about he needed to, uh, a law can't help him, this and that. So you start, you got to look watch the video, mm -hmm. and George Foreman was like, that I was remember totally that. out of line. Mm -hmm. So, you know, he, he's, you know, he can get away with it, man. Like, and HBO you know, allows him to get away yeah, with it, which yeah, is surprising to me. It. But listen, he better not let me catch him at a 7-Eleven somewhere or catch him on the street. I'm going to bust his ass. I don't care who, nobody can catch, stop him from that. Remember the Jim Lanley, I see you, I'm going to bust your ass. How about that? Run, tell that. Run, you know tell that. Yeah, sir. Y'all heard it from Brother Fareed. Yeah, train to perfection. Mobile soon to be global. Now it's the real train to let perfection. Let me show me shirt. And somebody stole my name, but it's the real train to perfection. But I own this. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? So that's how it's going to be. That's how it's going to be. And real quick, just one more time for the people who don't know, give them your history. You came up with Floyd Mayweather, Zab. Judah, you oh, trained yeah, Zab. Yeah, yeah. He was he was part of the team, the All USA team. team. 1996, travel with those guys. Me and Floyd went to Russia. I knew Floyd when he was Floyd Joy Mayweather Jr. You know what I'm saying? Then he went to be Floyd Joy. Then went to Pretty Boy Floyd. Then he went to you know what I'm saying? Money Mayweather, which is I mean fabulous, man. I can't wait to see him. And every time I see him, I just be happy because I knew him when he was. I used to cut his hair. I knew him when he was went when he was just telling me stories about he going to win a gold medal in the Olympics. They're going to do a story about his dad on HBO. He said he going to fight De La Hoya and he going to win. This was 1996. That's when he so, said that. 1996. So when he signed the contract and I knew that he was going to fight, I told him he was going to win and why. 
See, that's why you got to tell people two this people, kind of stuff. Two really? people told me stories back in 96. Antonio Tarver told me he was going to be Roy Jones. He told everybody. He said he was going to be Roy, Roy Jones? Jones? Antonio Tarver said, I'm going to be Roy Jones. Oh, Antonio okay. Tarver said it. I'm going to be Roy Jones. Roy said he's going to be De La Hoya. 20 years, 15 years later, those things have happened. Wow. So stick to your dreams, man. It's true. That's deep. That's deep, Reed. You want um, anyone to follow you? You want everyone to follow you and everything? You got yes, a, your social site? Uh, the real train to perfection. Follow me on um, uh, Instagram. You know, I got a YouTube page. It's train to perfection. Um, brother Fareed, brother underscore Fareed on um, Twitter. You know what I'm saying? Facebook, you can find me, Fareed Samad. And then I got a train to perfection page also. Just, 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 you know, hook me up. You can even call me or text me. My number is everywhere.